In the trim dialog we can select one or more video segments. The video segments can be rendered to different videos or joined to one video. To open the trim dialog, select a video and press video trim button, or double click on the video. Double click on a video opens the video trim or the color correction, it can be configured in the options dialog. Here we can find the video controls, play, stop, pause, forward or backward the video one second, or frame by frame. We can select an audio track from the source video. And mute the audio while playing. This button activates the seek to keyframes mode. When working with interframe codecs, this mode decodes only to keyframes. This is useful for example when cutting a video for re-wrapping without re-encoding, in this case the trims are only allowed between keyframes. We also can add a poster frame to the video, the poster frame is used in move videos. To set a poster frame, go to a video frame and press the button set poster frame. After setting a poster frame, it can be checked by pressing the button go to poster frame. The poster frame will be included when selecting a move encoder in the produce panel. The MXF OP Atom format supports markers including custom information. By activating the button markers you can check, create and delete markers for the video. For more information about markers see the MXF format tutorial. To select a video segment, mark the in frame. The out frame, and press the button add segment to list. The segment will appear in the video segments list with the start time, the end time and the duration of the segment. To delete a segment or all segments, press the button remove all, or remove selected segments. We can select more segments and add them to the list. After the video segments have been created, we can select a segment by double clicking on it, and then play the segment in loop mode. When processing the final video, a video will be created for each segment, in this case three videos will be produced. But, if the join mode is active, a video will be created with all the segments joined. When the join mode is active, the order of the segments will be used to create the final video, we can change the order of the segments in the video segments list. When join mode is not active, we can set a custom file name for each segment, if not set the file name will be taken from the source video. For example, to set a custom file name for a segment, select it, press the button file name, and enter a file name. This file name is assigned only to selected segment. The show time code option, adds the source video time code to the segment's time code only for checking purposes, this doesn't modify the time code. We can also export and import a list of video segments to the hard drive. The segments list exported from a video can be imported in a different video. Finally after creating all the segments, press the OK button to continue the configuration or render the videos. Thanks for watching.